YSU plans to release the results of a massive study that examines the cost effectiveness of all its academic programs and its buildings. The study will presumably shape the future of academics at the university in terms of what needs to be expanded or in some cases cut. Yeah, Matt Stone explains where they're at in the process and why the faculty has some concerns. Universities are required to perform an academic program review as part of their accreditation process. YSU is doing one now. Data is collected to find out what academic programs are in demand and which ones aren't. Universities all over the Northeast and Midwest are expected to see declining enrollments due to declining populations. YSU has seen a declining enrollment since 2010. That's why they're preparing for the possibility of eliminating programs and consolidating buildings or other campus spaces. We just want to make sure that the space that we have is being utilized to its greatest effect. And um, that's what this process will, uh, will involve. But as the university readies its new master plan, a spokesperson for the faculty union says they were feeling left out since they've provided information about their programs a while ago, but haven't heard anything. They're concerned about their jobs. We've gone through this process. We know everything's been submitted and yet we haven't gotten any feedback, even the minimal amount of feedback of here's where we are. We'll be getting back to you in you know X number of weeks. That's, that hasn't even been done. So again, the faculty are very much in the dark about what the next step is in this whole process. YSU spokesperson Ron Cole says the university will eventually ask for feedback from faculty, students, and the community, but they aren't at that point just yet. No timetable for that has been given. With more local news, I'm Matt Stone.